Hello everybody, this is Quiversy, and welcome back to more Let's Play Bioshock Blind. Last time, we finished our transformation, as it were, into a big daddy, and got ourselves a little friend here, a little sister to help us on our way. Which, again, I, I'm looking at her and I swear she doesn't look, look she doesn't look like she is corrupted by Adam. She looks normal. Although the apparent health bar she has implies otherwise. Uh, but, yeah, well, I still have no idea how this whole thing works. In this part, we have to go to a place called the Proving Grounds. I don't know what waits for us here, but I'm guessing it has something to do with killing Fontaine. I guess we'll find out. The little ones will lead you to Fontaine. Hurry! But hurry, you must Mr. protect them. Yeah, she's she's in, she doesn't even have the demonic voice. Okay. Well, before I go anywhere else, let's take a look at Yeah. This is an escort mission. Okay, this place looks to just have two relatively large floors, but... Hi, Mr. B. <laughs> Angels are waiting for our kiss. That's it, kid. Hello, Mr. B. Hello, Mr. B. Angels don't wait for slowpokes. Angels don't wait for slowpokes, huh? Maybe she's freshly inducted or something. That sounds like another big daddy. It is. You know, you may not be all demonic and twisted looking, but you certainly don't sound right in the head. Then again, who in here is? <laughs> I really hey, want you up with that wife and child. Hey, oh, oh, me poor Moira. I me wee baby Patrick. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll get me a real family. They play well with the suckers. The m hey! Hey! Pause off! That's it! Go away! In fact, you don't get to go away. What? Bad. Actually, you know what? I don't know why that didn't destroy the thing. Uh, this ain't going too well. What? You two die! There. And you know what? Let's just take that. Okay, where'd you go? There you are. Oh man, you took a lot of damage. Who? You are not making this easy, little girl. You're not so tough now, are ya? Hey! Alright, you know what? Let's go to lightning, because I know you'll fall by Zappy. Are you gonna do that? Okay. I'm coming, I'm coming. Dancing in the sky. I know you see the eight. test subject one. Uh oh. This one's a book, Mr. Grimm. Don't be afraid. Even though they are to be physically free of their hands to gather, the child's mental conditioning still holds them to their terrible task. Since for still such a thing, you can 
never apologize. That's why she doesn't look demonic. She's free from the slug creature, but she's brainwashed into thinking she needs to do this. That's why. Which means if I didn't rescue her, would she have appeared demonic? And that also explains why after I freed them and they thanked me, they still talk about Mr. B and the angels whenever they crawl away in the vent. It is even more tragic than I thought they were. Seriously, there's just no escape for them. They're stuck like this. I see you over there. And in fact, I'll kill you. You can't disturb the little thing. She's having it hard enough. Hey! The little one fall, you can call for another at the vent. But to lose even one is a thing. Number one. I was fighting as hard as I could. Number two. She wouldn't leave that stupid corpse alone. Even though she kept harassing me to chase after her. And number three. Time to go. I think that also means that if I didn't save them all, they'd be invincible. And you're the one who's being slow. Dancing in the sky. You can't even see the sky. Dang it, I'm just making myself more sad. Time to go, Mr. B. Now I'm gonna comment on my whole controller situation. Hurry, hurry, Mr. Bubbles. I seriously had it fully charged before I started today. I don't know why it's already at zero again. Hurry, Mr. B. Angels are waiting for a You know what? I should probably do some of my more distracting plasmids. So I have a feeling she's probably going to stop at the test subject and gather more at him. Don't be a slowpoke, Mr. B. Angels don't wait for slowpokes. You're the slowpoke! Okay, good. Ignore it. Going, we're going. You're the one who's holding this up. Now please activate the vent. Give us a checkpoint. Need one of this right now because this is kind of ridiculous. Hurry, hurry, Mr. Bubbles. 
I hurry. Okay, I guess it's activated now. The light's green. Oh! Hey, um, just switch <coughs> There we go. Time to go, Mr. B. Wait, that's a turret. Excuse me. Get out of the way, jeez. Don't be a Buy it out. Slowpoke, Mr. B. Angels don't wait for slowpoke. Uh oh. Yeah, she's moving to it. Hurry, Mr. B. Watch out! The threat is now to destroy the attention of this blacksmith. Okay. <laughs> Why wasn't this loaded? Okay. Yeah, target dummy. Ignore the sister, go for the dummy. Yes! Alright, good. You're gone. You're gone. You're gone. I'm running out of Eve. You're burning alive. Are you done? You're actually done! You made it! Alright! Oh, hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Who's shooting the little girl? Hello? Hurry, hurry, Mr. Bubbles. I'm hurrying. Uh oh. No! Don't shoot the little girl. Dancing in the sky. All right, we made it all the way to the third checkpoint without having to use the second one. Hurry! Where hurry. are we? We're in the central atrium, gonna go through the north wing. So we actually don't have that much farther left to go, it looks like. Hurry, Mr. Bubbles. Oh! What about there? No subject in view. That is totally Mr. Bubbles! Don't be a slowpoke, Mr. B. Angels don't Hi. It didn't hurt you. Time to go, Mr. B. I don't really have much to add to this. This is just uh follow the little girl. Hurry, Mr. B. I'm honestly not wild about this part. If only because of how slow our escort is. Although I did see... Yep. Okay. I thought I missed, but I guess I hit. <sighs> At least there they are friends. But it's better now that it's bunch, just a bunch of turrets. Uh, hold that thought, little girl. Okay. We should be about at the end of this section. Uh oh. Wait for it. And smack! Hurry, Mr. B. I can see the angel. I don't know where you're seeing angels. Oh jeez! You were seeing some angels. Wait. Yes! See, 
that's the problem with hiding in the water when you live in a place like Rapture. I mean, Electro Bolt was the first plasmid we got. It's not a good idea to hide in the water. Dang, I missed. Alright, can I freeze you, please? Ah, dang it. Alright, you know what? Come on, come on, come on, switch! Where? Get rid of it, get rid of him. There. Okay, the bot's disabled. And you know what? I'm buying him. Dang little sister keeps end up ending up in my way. Ah, oh, great. Not another one. What have you done? The little one has fallen. Now you must find the head and bring forth another little one. <sighs> I feel bad for them. But at the same time, they're kind of doing it to themselves! Alright, where's the... Oh, it's right here. Good. At least I didn't lose any progress. Do I have any Eve anywhere? Doesn't look like it. Because I can't super prepare myself. For the upcoming ambush. That's fair. Where am I? Wait, did my goal move? Oh no, my goal is a sister. What? Am I stuck? Come here. Nope. I'm stuck on the robot! What do you want? I don't even know where we're going here. Oh, we need to go around and through and, and okay. But first... I'm gonna use it for a target dummy. Ooh, I've got an idea. Whoa, hey, whoa, 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 hey! There. Go to the oil! Fire! Gonna get rid of the oil. I was planning on maybe using it, but ah, whatever. Okay, it did get used. Nice. Ah. I didn't think they would actually just run into it. I guess I overestimated the intelligence of splicers. Oh, there goes my buzzing friend. I really hope this is the last test subject because. This is getting tedious. That's putting it mildly. Okay. Spider! Slicer! Okay, it looks like she's finished. Moving on. Hurry! Hurry, Mr. Bubbles! Alright, so this is the way forward. Why do you hate me? Oh, jeez. Why do you hate me? That did some damage. You are not Mr. B! 
need today! I am getting Mr. B! For I am Mr. B! Jeez. Was he attacking me because there was a sister following me? Better for the girl to be with you. Better with you than alone. Alone in the crawling darkness. She says after I have caused three, four of them to die. Time to go, I mean, it was never my intention, of course, but it did happen. What's in here? What was in the bouncer's hidey hole? Ooh, I got that! Yes! More Eve. And proximity mines that I can't use. Alright, I'm, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. That's a turtle. Where? Where am I? I'm a little turn around. Oh, okay. Going through here. His voice sounded different. Pompeii is nearby. You want to chin close? Okay, our escort is complete. There. You must use the needle of the little sister to drain Fontaine of his Adam. It is the only way to defeat him. Here, take this. Stick it in the bad man. Fontaine waits above. Okay. There will be no going back from here. Make sure you are ready to face him before moving on. It's not its own weapon or anything. Okay. Well, this is it. Well. Then... Anything else for free I can get? Nothing I can hold. We got ourselves all the tools to prepare. This is shaping up to be a big final battle. I'm gonna guess there's nothing I can buy for ten. Of course there was another health and Eve upgrade. I could have used the... Should have held on to my Adam. Should have done that. Oh well. It is what it is. Either way, next time on Let's Play Bioshock Blind, I'm going to do some last minute preparations with these vending machines. And then we go up and take down Frank Fontaine. There was, a, there was something I could pick up. Is there a lockbox over here or something? Hang on. Ooh, frag grenades I missed. Okay, there was, it just had ammo in it. Um, but yes, next time we will go and take on Frank Fontaine. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.